I see you're back for part two. Thanks. Um, still not bald. Hey guys, welcome back. I went ahead and prepped the pot and sketched all of my Eevee pictures on there, and now I'm ready to work. My first idea for this pot was to have all of the evolutions around the pot, similar to the last pot with the Charizards. But I thought that having too many characters on the pot would mean that I would have to sketch them smaller, which would be harder to paint. I also have a bad habit of not mixing enough paint, so I was worried that I would have to keep up with all these different colors, and if I ran out of one, I wouldn't be able to replicate it. If you pay close attention, you'll notice that the Eevees tend to change the shade of brown that they are, because I wasn't mixing enough paint. pot I wanted all of these normal Eevees to look like they were out in a big field of flowers. So I painted the background a light green and splotched on purples and pinks to look like bunches of flowers around them. Like I mentioned in my last video, I gave up on using a marker for the lines. Instead, I'm taking a paintbrush with only a small amount of paint on the tip and I'm very carefully painting on the lines. Painting the lines got easier the more I did it, but I still had to cover up a few mistakes here and there. Now I'm adding the eye shines and the highlights to Evie's fur.
After that, I seal the pot and here is the finished product. For the last pot, I sketched this idea and I got halfway through painting it when I decided I didn't like it. So I grabbed my pocket knife and scraped off that paint to start again. I finally decided on a picture I liked, so I went ahead and did the graphite method, and you can barely see it on there. For this one, I decided a summer design would be nice, so I found pictures of Pikachu and Eevee in a summer vibe and put them together. Pikachu sunglasses gave me a lot of trouble. At first, I wanted them to be a deep purple, but I wasn't liking how that looked, so I painted them gray thinking that would make them look more normal, but it just made it look awful. So I tried mixing the purple and the gray together, but that didn't help, so I just left it alone for a while. You'll notice here that all of Evie's paint has been scraped off. I really can't remember what was going through my mind when I scraped it off. I think I was just frustrated that I couldn't get the color right, and it got so messy that I just started over on it. But I eventually got Evie where I wanted him. Now I'm back with a dark purple in Pikachu's glasses, only this time I'm employing my Posca paint pens to do details for both Evie and Pikachu. I'm using my dark blue and light blue Posca pens to make a gradient across his glasses, smudging the paint with my finger so it mixes lightly in the middle. And don't forget the highlights! For the background, I wanted a summer feel, so I'm making it look like they're both on a cruise ship with the sky and some railing in the background. I also added a berry on the table in the background to give it more color. Like I said, I don't know much about Pokemon, so I don't know exactly what kind of berry this is or what it does, but it fit the theme, so I'm putting it in there. For the railing in the background, I painted them white because I didn't want any harsh colors in the background. 
I also used a blue watercolor pencil to sketch them on and shade them. I added a small margarita glass between them to keep up with the theme, and also add some more color. I also thought Pikachu could use the alcohol. With the last few lines drawn on here, it's finally time to see what all the pots look like in their final form. I am super proud with how all of them turned out. They were so fun to paint, and I hope you like them too. But now it's time to see how the person getting these thinks about them. Please enjoy the reveal. Let's see what we got here. Flower pots from Katie. Bye, Katie. Oh, that's awesome! That's gorgeous. <laughs> Claire's gonna love that. So what is that one? In, uh, Eevee? In, in, Eevee, okay. Uh-huh, that's her favorite Pokemon. Your mom did Pokemon with you, I never did Pokemon. Oh my goodness. Your mom wanted to keep all of them, she didn't want to give it in too much, she saw them. That's absolutely amazing. I love it. Look inside of it, the, the flames go all the way in. That's phenomenal. Did an amazing job. Thank you so much. If you like this video and you want to see more, please like and subscribe. Also leave a comment telling me what you thought and what you'd like to see next. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.